Hi guys, welcome back to our channel. If you are new here, I am Daniel. I'm Chelsea. And this is our YouTube channel. We do videos on our relationship and random things and obviously I do things on midway free and travelling and all that. So if you are new here, please hit the subscribe button down below. But today we are doing the moving in Q&A because me and Daniel will now live together. A minute ago I was Chelsea and now I'm Daniel, so you yeah. know how the game goes. <laughs> but yeah, so we live together now, so we thought we would do a Q&A as we have some questions to answer. <clears throat> about it. So are you ready? Let's have it. Right, cool. So the first, first question is, why are you moving in together? To be honest, getting to work, it's easy to travel. You know, I'm near a train station, I get to work easily, like, it's not no laughing, I'm joking, <laughs> the look. Um, obviously, because I love her, yeah. you know, she's my wife to be, and yeah. No problems with where I lived before, the people there were amazing, you know who you are. Um, but yeah, no. You just thought it was better for our relationship. Travelling from where I had to travel to come to see Chelsea, uh, three times or four times a week was ridiculous, so yeah. this is easy for me. And like we only really seen each other on the weekends. So. Yeah, work life is crazy. Yeah, so we thought it was best to move in. Mm -hmm. And yeah. Yeah, that is says, no regrets, no regrets. <laughs> so this kind of links to this question. So is why don't you think you moved in too quickly? Because we moved in. Why don't we, what? Like, do you think we moved in too quickly? No. Because we, um, to Mark, so we moved in at 11 months we were together 11 months when we moved in so yeah well worth it most people would think that would be too too early to move in together the thing is though we was like seeing each other three four times a week anyway um i would come over on a friday stay friday saturday sunday go to work monday sometimes you can come back on a monday and then probably go home on a tuesday and then be back on like thursday it was like it's crazy yeah. so yeah so we felt like this was right for us yeah yeah, so every relationship is different, obviously, but our relationship's quite. Um, Volatile, I'm joking. <laughs> no, our relationship's um, very much full on, like, we kind of like. I don't know, it's just. It was really strong from like, the start, basically, so we just kind of knew, like, this was. This is right for us, so. This is where we stop and play, like, a love song. <laughs> You know, like a Mariah Carey or <laughs> I'll make love to you like you want me to. Like a montage going on. Okay, um, where will you be living? So, we live at my house, which is my parents' house right now. Yeah, don't worry about destination. <laughs> yeah, you don't need to obviously know. If you know, then you know, but... Um, yeah, so we live with my parents, so... I know most people think that's weird, but... I have a good relationship with my mum and my dad um me and chelsea and her mum are more like three friends yeah but two of us are dating yeah so so um it's, it's you a, felt right i'm obviously my mum was okay with it mm -hmm. so she loves me fine. i mean everyone loves me <laughs> so yeah that's where we are living um are you sharing rent i should hope so <laughs> i should hope. i'm not a freeloader <laughs> yeah. i i pay what well, i pay one month's rent <laughs> Equals three months of her rent, so... Shush. <laughs> obviously, I'm part-time, so I don't obviously earn a lot compared to Daniel. Yeah. So I don't pay as much, but yeah. So. Um, how you deal with arguments? Um, <laughs> not very well. <laughs> uh, to be fair, before it was a bit stressed, but like we've learned to kind of cope well with arguments now. It's so like Daniel will go like to the park just for a walk just so he can calm down a bit and then we'll come back and then we kind of just... We're human. Yeah, we get back on track. We argue, I'm up in her face, she's up in my face. <laughs> and then I'll take a walk, have a walk about, come back, sorry baby, we love you, sorry baby, we love you, kiss, cuddle and then that's it, we're back oh, to fine. it. Yeah, so, but... From the start to now, we've improved with our arguments. Yeah. Yeah, we've become more... We're both Aries, so... Yeah, Aries are very fiery, if you know your signs. Yeah, those people that are into astrology, we're very um, Aries. Yeah. Buttonheads. We're definitely, like, 
are fine. Many dinner a time has been a war. Many dinner time has been a war. But, you know, they say after war is love. Yes. So. We're good. <laughs> Alright, who's the messiest? Now, this is a hard one because I I'm, think we're both messy. I'm sort of... I, I'm, I'm not really OCD, but I like to be clean. But my drawers of clothes are just too much. So, I mean, I'm... Obviously, I work in Primark. And I like my T-shirts to be perfect at work. And it's the same at like home so like, I fold all these t-shirts nice and stuff and these flannels and sponges and these boxes and everything and then I go in them like two days later and it's just smashed I'm like I've just done that and I literally do it all the time I'm like I'm just fed up of it it's so messy when it comes to clothes I'm, I'm a man but if you saw the state of this bedroom but to I'm, be I'm... fair that's both of us because you've always got clothes all over the floor and you're rubbish yeah so I think both of us are quite... Do you know what? I'll, I'll be a man messy. and I'll admit that I'm, I'm also in the wrong. So yeah, both of us. Yeah. We should have just led with that, shouldn't we? Well, do you share laundry? Uh, what do they mean? As in, like, do you separate your laundry or do you do it together? No, or? no, she's got 30 things <laughs> and I've got... 30 things. 30 things, then they go together, like... Yeah. Like, most of the time my mum does the washing obviously we don't expect her to do that obviously but she does she's amazing in general I love her. like we just kind of put all the clothes together that way sometimes obviously if we need something urgently then we'll do it ourselves um and obviously to help mum out i do washing as well sometimes so yeah i must admit you do put a good load on i do do, put you a good do. Load you on. do. yeah um okay who's the best cook to be fair i can just put yeah, yeah i can burn cereal so to be fair, none of us are really the greatest cooks, but I can do more than Daniel can. Yeah. There's a few dishes I can do due to my mum teaching me, but I'm still in the process of learning, to be fair. So I'm not the best housewife right now. But good job I'm not going to be a housewife, is it? That's right. We're both working, baby. So yeah. both bringing in that sweet moolah. Exactly. So. I had a bowl of churros earlier. It went all over the shop. And I burnt it somehow, so and I didn't even use an appliance, so yeah, definitely not the best cook. <laughs> um, do we find time to be alone, like, for like, alone time? Too much, too much. Do you know the funniest thing, our alone time is Chelsea's on the bed over there, that sounds so rude, and she's on her phone. Or my laptop. Or, or a laptop. And I'm sitting here on the PlayStation 4, and in trophies and doing my yeah. thing. So, or I go downstairs and watch TV with my mum because we've got recordings and stuff that we watch together. So so I picture this last night from about 8 o'clock till, till nearly 3 o'clock this morning. Chelsea was on the bed behind us on the laptop, headphones in, whatever. And I was on the PlayStation 4. It, it's just, This is our alone time. So yeah. Yeah, that's pretty much what we get. Yeah. Obviously when we go back to work. It'll be different because yeah, then we'll, we'll have like the whole day away from each other. Nine hours of no seeing each other, come back to it, and hopefully, yeah. Yeah, because we have found it hard in lockdown. Yeah. Yeah. We've it, gone it's from hard. not seeing each other for five weeks straight to literally living Being together twenty four seven. Literally. <laughs> so it has. It has been a bit full on, but it's been okay. Mm. So, um, was it hard adjusting to living together? No. No, it kind of felt like normal. It did because like natural. I'd come up like I said on a Friday night and I'd stay Friday, Saturday, Sunday. And sometimes on Monday. Sometimes on Monday, go work, come back here and then go on Tuesday, maybe be back Thursday night, Friday, Saturday. No, it, it's just... So it pretty much was normal. Obviously it was, we had the five week break so obviously I went to Ghana for four weeks and then I had to self-isolate for a week so Daniel couldn't see me. That was so hard. It was very hard being away from him so like I find it... We find it worse when we're away from each other, so I think living together is like the perfect situation for both of us. We argue more when we're not together. Yeah. You know, and I get a bit moaning and depressed when I'm not with you tonight. Yeah. So I think moving together was like the best thing the best for idea. our relationship. Definitely, it makes you stronger. Yeah. What doesn't kill you makes you stronger. Um, okay. Do you have any pet peeves about each other? Too many to mention. Like, say one, just one. She does this thing with her nails. She will pick at her nails and it just makes me cringe because you'll go to hold her hand and you'll just see these bits of like blood and skin on that oh and I'm always telling her. I'm like, stop. 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 Sorry. 
My pet that. peeve about you it's really interesting. has got to be... Oh, I know. Oh, Hashtag Snorosaurus. Oh, yeah. Oh, okay. Then that's technically two then. Okay. Well, I'll, I'll allow two. Yeah, the snoring. Oh, my God. The snoring. I feel like the snoring's gotten worse lately as well. It's like... <laughs> oh, oh, my God. I literally up and out. I'm like, I want to kill you. <laughs> because he was just, like, so loud. And I just wanted to sleep. And, like, I have to put, like, dankles in the Mexican wall because I get my other pillow and just put it over my head. It's I'm, a like, divide. It's sleep. a border. And the other one is him eating in bed because he gets all these crumbs on the mattress and it's just disgusting because I feel like, ugh, I'm sleeping with chocolate or a piece of crisp. It's just, it's not nice. I'm a big guy, I need to eat. I need eating in bed's the one. No, I just, yeah, that's, that's something I don't like, definitely. Um, okay. Something you have learned about each other that you didn't know before living together. Um, how fantastic Chelsea is at... Uh, being an entrepreneur, buying and selling, and also really pushing herself, really being positive about things. She's kind of setting herself goals and she's going for it rather Aww. than, yeah, you've really kind of shown me that when you do want something, how much you, if pushed or if given that little bit of confidence, you take it and you run with it. And I love that. So, Thank yeah, you. you showed me last few days how how impressed I am with you, if that makes sense, well, yeah. you know what I mean, but yeah. Aww, baby, mm. that's cute! <laughs> Mine has got to be, I knew Daniel was like a clean freak, but I've noticed it more, because obviously I'm living in the same house as him now, so like, every Saturday, he cleans like basically the whole house, like he'll do the bathroom, the kitchen, he'll hoover our room and tidy it up and stuff, it's like, he's very much on cleanliness. And he likes to have the house clean and, you know, hoover the room, change the bed and all that, which is really good. I think that's good because you don't really generally get that in a man. For you Especially, guys out yeah. there, there's no need to be dirty. It's not a woman's job. It's any person's job. Yeah, so, it's yeah. like he definitely doesn't just expect me to do the cooking, the cleaning no, no. and all that. It's kind of like teamwork. It is. We work yeah. as a team and, you you know, you're a caterpillar. that All legs are going the same way. So. Yeah, so it's a teamwork for sure. But yeah, so that's all the questions. So, you know, that's us moving in together. It's been what now? Coming up to, on the 20th of May, it'll be two months. It so doesn't we'll seem it. I know. It doesn't seem it. Yeah. One thing you could, if you could change one thing about me living here, what would it be? I wouldn't change anything. Oh, well, I probably said the snoring. Oh, yeah, the snoring is quite bad, yeah. Yeah, mm. maybe the snoring. But everything else, it's just like, it's great having you here. Yeah, same. Obviously, like, it hasn't been great with the whole lockdown. No. But I've really liked living with you. Yeah. And it just shows that like, this is really what I want in our future and stuff. And it'd be nice to, like, we'll eventually have our own place. Yeah. Because I want it that way. <laughs> yeah, yeah, with little kids and stuff, so. Yeah, yeah we're definitely. planning marriage children. It'll be good. Plenty of videos come yeah. in. So if you do subscribe, if you like, if you like kids, that's wrong. If you like family. family things, there'll be plenty of that coming in. Plan with our little ones. Little ones. We've got so much ideas and stuff for like pregnancy videos, when we actually have kids and all that. Getting married. This will yeah. be marriage things. Oh, we marriage, have a marriage series. Marriage that's series. Like, it's like a documentary, but Literally yeah. Documentary subscribe and you've got it all to come. I mean, you yeah. know. We are doing, we're going to be doing a video soon of our five year plan, like revealing our five year plan to each other to see like kind of like what, if we're on the same path, like what we want in the next five years kind of thing. So mm -hmm. Sounds good. We've got that to come on the soon video, so look out for that one too. To be continued. Yes. So we hope you enjoyed this video. Yeah, I hope you're all staying in lockdown, stay safe. Stay safe. Big yeah. up all the NHS key workers and start NHS staff and everything else. You're doing an amazing job. We love you and we're thankful yes, for it. Exactly. So we will see you next Friday for a new video. Like, comment, subscribe, please. Yes, we need all the love from you guys. Yes. And um, obviously Sunday's videos that I post myself, so look out for Sunday's video too. And yeah, so we will see you next time. Bye. Bye.